everybody, welcome back to my channel. I have a really fun video for you guys today. I did a video where I styled my brother's clothes after I was robbed and didn't have any clothes to work with. And you guys seem to really like that video and I've been wanting to do another version of that again. So today I'm styling my boy groom Brandon's clothes. He has a totally different style from my brother, so I thought that this would be really fun. It's kind of seeing what I can do with pieces I'm not used to out of my comfort zone. And this is a testament to me saying accessories work and can make and break your outfit. Before we get into this video though, I wanted to say thank you so much to New Way for sponsoring this video. I'm wearing their new bra right now, the 2021 Barely Zero. And then I have the new underwear on as well. I'll be wearing these under all the pieces I style today. They are so basic, so nice, go well under anything. And since I'm not going to be wearing any of my own clothes today, I thought keeping it super basic, tried and true with these undergarments would be perfect for today's video. New Way has a super expansive sizing, no matter the body type. They're amazing to work out in and just super versatile. The Barely Zero bra is size adaptive and eliminates that frustration of shopping and finding the right bra size online. The bra was made to live in. You can literally do whatever in it. I've been wearing mine nonstop since I got it in the mail. And when looking online, your size is the size for this bra. New Way literally means inside out and I feel like there's not a better way to describe this product than that. There's an on-site sale right now. You can get an extra 10% off for the Barely Zero collection and 30% off for the spring sale. So make sure to check out the link in the description box to shop all the New Way products. Okay, so here's the first outfit we've got on of Brandon's. All black can look really chic, effortless, but cool girl when done right. I don't know if I'm doing it right here. <laughs> so these jeans are, they're not too big. I did the like TikTok hack through the belt loop. That's literally always my go-to. And I don't hate the way the like waist even looks on me really, but I don't mind just covering it more with just an equally baggy t-shirt. I added a ton of gold chains, my little Gucci purse. Having a tiny bag when you've got a really big outfit can sometimes balance out that super masculine look with a really feminine purse. And then I've got my Adidas Sambas. They're like my new favorite shoes. I think having a little bit of a thinner silhouette on the shoe can help also balance out the baggy outfit. That might seem crazy, but I think what's throwing me off is my hair down. I'm gonna slick it back and let's see if that helps. I think that helped it honestly so much. Also, I wanted to show you guys, <laughs> if you have like bangs or a lot of layers or something use this gel to slick back your hair and it will stay all day doesn't the hair slicked back just totally change up the look it really does help it i'm kind of vibing with it now but i think this is cute now i would totally wear this if brandon and i get stranded at his house and i only have his clothes to pick from i can definitely make do all black is just super chic even with all baggy and then he also has this hoodie i want to show you guys before i put this hoodie on this t-shirt is from Leftover Booth. It's actually Brandon's clothing company. He makes these t-shirts. I haven't really said anything about it, but I've been wearing his clothes on like Instagram and my channel. He didn't want like me to shout it out or anything, but I feel funny now if I just tell you it's Leftover Booth and I don't tell you guys it's Brandon. Secrets out, these jeans, I have no idea where they're from. He thrifted them for sure. But then this hoodie I think would be cute too because it's black. This is from the brand Fucked, but it's not the bad word, it's F-U-C-T. Yeah, I think that this is really cute. This is like my style to a T. Brandon and I have super similar style. Let's get on to the next outfit. Okay, again, I think this is a really good outfit. I love this little fleece plaid pullover, like quarter zip. This is something I would never pick out myself to buy. But Brandon's worn it a few times, and every time he does, I'm like, oh, I want that. Like, it's so cute. But for me to buy it, I'd be like, absolutely not. I think he got it from, like, Eddie Bauer or something. Eddie Bauer Cabela's, one of those, at, like, an outlet mall. So I paired it with a pair of his jeans. These ones are a little bigger than the last pair, so they're not fitting me as well. But I had to pick them out because he screen printed on the butt 
these two little Medusa heads. This is one of his designs on like a bunch of his t-shirts. He screen prints all his t-shirts himself. To match my black shoulder bag, again, I wanted to make it a little more feminine with the little shoulder bag. I put on my platform Doc Martens. This is so something like Hailey Bieber would wear. Am I crazy? Or do I just feel like I look like her with her slicked back hair and hoops? I'm channeling her energy. If you're wearing really baggy clothing, slick back your hair, add a ton of jewelry to like make it a little more feminine, and a little shoulder purse. It can really make or break the outfit. If I didn't have these on, I'd look a little bit bummy. No offense, Brandon. <laughs> this might look really familiar to you guys. I look like, this reminds me so much, and she's my inspo for everything. I need to look up her username. It's T-Z-E Fits. I don't know how to say her name. That's so rude of me. She has the coolest outfits and is so good about dressing like oversized things with the slick back hair and making it look so good. And I feel like this outfit's gonna look even more like her when I add the next thing. I don't know, like it's kind of cool. It's not really my style 100%. I just can't imagine like putting this on and really thinking I'm gonna go out and wear it, but it's kind of cool. You might recognize these pants from my brother's styling video. He has the same ones. They're actually both his. He gave this pair to Brandon. And I wanna take this pair. They're Nike SB camel pants. I don't know if they sell them anymore, but they're just so good. I paired them with my ALD New Balances because they've got like green and yellow. And then this shirt has yellow in it. This is another fucked t-shirt. It's got a guitar on it. And then Brandon thrifted this little fleece vest. I think it looks really cool. I've been seeing a lot of, what's this like tech wear? Is that what it's called? That might be stupid, but I think it looks pretty cool. I don't know, zipped or unzipped? And then this little bag is from Glint. It's G-L-Y-N-I-T, Glint. Doesn't really fit with the fit at all, but it makes it a little more feminine. I think you guys know I always like the look of like an all neutral outfit. This one's really cool. It's just like super summery, lightweight, light colored. My shoes are my Sambas again. I feel like when I just have this really baggy look, I like with my Sambas. These pants are thrifted. I think they're Dockers. Yeah, Dockers. I've got the same fucked t-shirt on and then the same purse from the last outfit, but we're gonna add another piece. I actually got this fleece for Brandon for Christmas last year and I want it. It's so good. It's from the brand Pleasures which is another brand that Brandon just likes on Instagram or something. <laughs> this is cute. Okay, this jacket's a little bit big on me, obviously. It looks really good on Brandon. I kind of love it. I love this jacket though. Is it not so cool? But this is a really cool outfit as well. I really like it. Okay, and here is the last outfit. We've got a pair of brown Dickies on. Um, I think these are straight off the Dickies website. They are pretty big on me, so they fit as like super, super low-waisted pants, but I don't really mind that look. The brown's super cute too. I've never seen brown Dickies, so maybe Brandon thrifted these. I don't know, but they feel pretty new, and they're like actually his size. Normally when he thrifts things, they're like way too, too big on him, so I think he got these in store. Then this shirt is really cool. It's kind of dirty on front because he said he messed up when he was screen printing and got some on the front on accident. This shirt is thrifted. I wish he didn't mess it up because this is such a good button down. It's got these really pretty, just like neutral stripes in it. And he screen printed this mushroom design on the back that I think is so cute. Can you guys see it? really light but it's like so subtle and adorable <laughs> and I just buttoned it a few buttons to make it a little more feminine and then I've got the same purse and my Sambas on I really like the look of this one too I think it looks really chic I feel like in okay in my opinion you would not be able to tell that I'm wearing my boyfriend's clothes in any of these fits. It just looks like they're my clothes maybe the screen printed jeans were a little baggy to get away with but this outfit really just looks like 
I knew what I was doing. <laughs> Brandon knew what he was doing, quite honestly. This is super cute. I really like this outfit too. I'm telling you guys, when I was over at Brandon's house looking through his clothes, I was like, this is not gonna be a good video. This is gonna suck. And I was thinking that when I was picking out Jackson's clothes too. Seeing them just laying out next to each other, you're like, oh God, absolutely not. As soon as you add your hair, your makeup, your accessories, your jewelry, your shoes, purse, anything, the outfit just completely changes and it turns into you. Like these don't look like Brandon's clothes right now. I can't even imagine Brandon owning, buying, wearing these clothes when I have them on my body. They just feel like me. So really put your clothes on and add all your accessories, your shoes, your hair, your makeup, your purse before you completely disregard an outfit. I really hope that you guys could see the transformation just from me having my hair down to putting it up or when I put away this purse. This outfit doesn't even need the purse, which is so good. You can see those little things, those little differences that change everything. I really want you guys to have fun with how you're styling your pieces and try new things and not get discouraged before you've even started. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I have a lot of fun making these kind of videos. If you have any video recommendations for me or ideas, make sure to comment them down below. Thank you again to New Wave for sponsoring this video. The comfiest bra and underwear. Make sure to check them out for that everyday life. Check the link in the description box to shop all the sales. And I think that's it. I'll see you guys in a few days. I love you the absolute most. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to. I love you. Bye.